The stadium lights went out, giving the stage a soft glow where Taylor Swift stood with her mic shaking a little. The crowd went silent as she spoke, her voice barely above a whisper. Tonight is a special night, she told the crowd, looking around. Not just because of you incredible fans, but because someone I love very much is here. Travis Kelsey, the tight end for the Kansas City Chiefs, was seen standing in a VIP box with a big smile on his face when the light flashed on. The crowd let out a collective gasp as Taylor went on, her voice getting stronger. Travis, you make my life so much better. I love you, you're my best friend, and many other things. There was a huge screen behind Taylor that showed pictures of the couple, and their laughter could be heard all over the stadium. As Taylor got to the end of her speech, tears were shining in her eyes. In all my years, I've never been more sure of anything. I want to be with you forever. Some people in the crowd were very excited. Is this the offer they've all been waiting for? Travis stood up and looked straight at Taylor with a smile that wouldn't go away. He took a big breath and spoke. The speakers picked up his voice. Oh Taylor, you mean the world to me. I love you more than words can say. It was easy for Taylor to cry now, and her heart was racing with hope. Then Travis's words went in a strange direction. But I'm not ready to get married yet. Not yet. There was a stunned silence in the crowd. Taylor's face was scrunched up, and tears were running down her cheeks. The picture on the screen behind her went out and back on. Travis went on, but his voice was filled with pain. I know you didn't want to hear this. I'm really sorry. But I have to tell you the truth. I need to tell the truth to myself. It was hard to hear Taylor's words as she slowly nodded. She said in a whisper, I get it. There was only one lighting on her, which showed her tears and the pain on her face. She took a weak breath and spoke to the crowd. She said with a teary voice, thank you for sharing this night with me. I love you all. As she walked off the stage with her head held high, she left a stunned and silent crowd behind her. When the stadium lights came back on, the stage was empty. End of show was shown on the screen as it came back to life. The crowd slowly spread out, whispering quietly as they did so. The sudden turn of events made their hearts heavy. Backstage, Taylor broke down and sobbed into her best friend's arms. Her sobs could be heard through the empty hallways. It hurt Travis's heart to be in his box because he missed her and longed for her. But one thing was clear as the lights went out and the stadium was empty, this was not the end of their story. It was just the start of a new story full of doubt, sadness, and the power of love that lasts. The stadium lights went out, giving the stage a soft glow where Taylor Swift stood with her mic shaking a little. When her boyfriend Travis Kelsey, a star tight end for the Kansas City Chiefs, showed up on the Jumbotron, the crowd cheered loudly. When Travis grinned, his eyes sparkled with fun, the crowd roared. He yelled, hey, Swifties, and his voice echoed through the stadium. I have a little surprise for your girl tonight. Taylor's heart beat faster as she thought about what was going to happen. After a million different thoughts, one question stood out, was Travis going to ask her to marry him? The screen then showed a pre-recorded film. Taylor's eyes grew wide when she saw Arrowhead Stadium, a place she knew well. Travis held a microphone and stood at the 50-yard line. Taylor, he said in a soft, sweet voice, I wanted to say something special to you in front of all your amazing fans. Taylor's eyes filled with tears as she watched Travis. Travis's words hit her like a warm hug. Travis went on, I know we haven't been together for that long, but I've never felt this way about anyone else. You're my best friend, my inspiration, and my crime partner. The sound of Taylor's heart beating in her chest made her breathe catch in her throat. Travis told her, I love you more than words can say. His voice was heavy with feeling. And I promise to love you fiercely, unconditionally, for the rest of our days. As she watched Travis talk, Taylor's tears were running easily down her face. When Travis winked, a fun grin spread across his face. Now, I know you're probably wondering if I'm about to propose, he said. And the answer is, not tonight. The crowd let out a combined gasp, but Taylor couldn't help but laugh, wiping her tears away with a hand that was shaking. 
But Taylor, Travis said in a serious tone, I want you to know that all I can think about is a future with you. I can see us getting married, having kids, and getting old together one day. Taylor's heart swelled with love, and she felt a wave of warmth. So tonight, Travis said, I just wanted to tell you in public that I love you and feel so lucky to have you in my life. And I'm excited to see what comes next for us. When the video finished, there were cheers all over the stadium. Taylor stood on stage with tears running down her face and a huge smile on her face. Travis hadn't asked her to marry him tonight, but the words he spoke meant more to her than any diamond ring ever could. As the first sounds of love story filled the stadium, Taylor started to sing. Her voice was full of hope and joy. When she looked up at the jumbotron, her eyes met Travis's. As he said, I love you, Taylor's heart filled with love and her smile grew. There wasn't a plan, but there was a promise. A promise of love, fun, and a happy ending. Taylor knew that this love story was just getting started as she sang. The stadium was rocking with happiness as a sea of red and gold fans cheered for their Kansas City Chiefs. The charming tight end Travis Kelsey was doing an interview on the field after the game. A reporter, wanting to get a story, didn't ask the normal football questions. Travis, the people want to know more. Are there any wedding bells on the way for you and Taylor? Travis laughed, and his usual charm came out in full force. Well, Taylor and I are just having a good time together right now. He stopped and seemed to think about what to say before continuing, when the time is right. He said. We'll see where life takes us. Taylor Swift watched the interview in her Nashville home, which was miles away. It broke her heart. Even though Travis carefully chose his words, they didn't make sense to her. People were interested in their quick relationship, which they had been having for a few months. Taylor had fallen deeply in love with Travis, and his contagious laugh and warm hugs filled her world. She didn't mean for tears to come up in her eyes. She dreamed of a life with Travis, full of shared laughs, snatched kisses, and maybe even a few Kelsies running around. Even though what he said wasn't a straight denial, it felt like a cold kick in the pants. It's possible that her thoughts were just that, dreams. Taylor wiped her tears away and picked up her phone. To understand what Travis was saying, she had to talk to him and hear his voice. Taylor's heart was beating fast when the phone rang. Travis picked up on the second ring, and his voice was full of worry. Babe, everything okay? Travis, I saw your interview. Taylor started, and her voice was shaking a little. Travis spoke up, but in a soft voice. Hey, pay attention. I'm sorry I made you angry. I didn't want to make things hard for us. Aren't we happy? Taylor said yes, but he couldn't see her. Yes, we are, she said in a soft voice. Travis said, let's just get that done. We'll figure the rest out together, one step at a time. As Taylor smiled, a wave of comfort went through her. Travis might have been right. They might not have needed to rush into anything. Maybe the story of their love was still being written. Every day was a new chapter full of love, happiness, and the hope of a future together. There were tears at first, but as they talked, there was hope instead. Even though the lights at the stadium were out, Taylor's love for Travis was stronger than ever. The hope of a future full of endless options kept her going.